Before we start this video, I do want to add that Twilio can and often does change their dashboard at any time. So we do apologize if this video looks a little different than what the site is currently, uh, but the information should still be good. Thank you. Here, we're gonna be taking a look at how to sign up for Twilio for your Atom software. So the first step is you are going to go to Twilio.com and you're gonna click on this sign up button right here. So once you do that, it'll ask for your first name, last name, uh, email address, and then a password. And you check this box too. So you enter that in, you can start your free trial. Uh, you will need to upgrade to the paid version in order for it to work with your software, but the free trial is a good place to start. So you click on this. And then it'll send you a email uh, just to verify that you are you. So I'll go and take care of that. All right, so I verified my um, email on here and then now it wants you to verify a phone number. So I'll go ahead and add that. All right, so I verified my phone number on there. And so then once you do that, uh, it'll ask you if you write code. Uh, you can just say no. Ask what you're here to do. So you can do get to a number to use a different service. Um, and they can from here, you can just do other. And then this will take you to your Toyo project dashboard. Now from right here, uh, the first thing you want to do is click this upgrade project button. And then on this page, you'll just want to fill out all this information here, your company address, uh, your billing address, and your payment information and funds. And then once you've done that, you can just click this upgrade account button. So after you've done that, you'll want to get yourself a number. And to do that, you could, on your dashboard, just click this button here. Or you could click on these three dots on the left-hand side. Phone numbers. This is where you could see your active numbers, if you had any. But also, you could click this buy number right here. And the number that you're looking for, um, I mean, we usually recommend that you get one that is close to your office number. Um, and also, too, it needs to be um, SMS capable. So once you have that number, uh, you'll need to write that down. And also, you'll need to send over to us uh, not only the number, but also your account SID and your authorization token. Both of these are found on your dashboard. And so, yeah, you could just send us a portal message uh, with the number, with your account SID, and your authorization token. And then we can get your software equipped with Tulio. All right, so the very last step is setting up the relay for your number. And so what you're gonna have to do is come over on the left, hit the three little dots, and click on phone numbers. You click on that, and then you'll click on the number that you just bought. And then in here, you're gonna have to type in a link for this one and a link for this one. So this top one is just purely for uh, when people call your Tulio number, uh, that will get forwarded to your office number. And so that link is And then after this equals sign, you're just going to plug in your office number. All right, and it should match this right there. But also, too, you could check uh, your Atom help menu, and we should have a uh, um, set of instructions that have these links on there. So that's for when a call comes in. Now for messaging, it's going to be pretty similar to your Atom software link. Um, I have it actually pre-filled in right here. Uh, the only thing different is at the end you're going to add a forward slash in this Twilio.aspx. And of course, you're going to want to have your Atom code in here as well. So that is the final step in setting up this for your software. And then after you've done this, you just have to wait for our programmer to turn it on. So 
Uh, that is it for the Twilio setup, and I thank you for watching.